Hi guys, Top Pops here, and today we're going pop hunting. We're going over to a couple stores today. You guys really liked the Toy Story Mystery Minis that I picked up over at Target. So maybe if they have a couple more of them, I'll get them. Because I did get the 1 in 72 Benson, and I got the black and white Woody, and then I got the Bo Peep as well. So that we did really well with that one. Two of the exclusives out of the three from Target. So I want to get the other ones to see if I can get more of that set, because I really do want to complete it. There is an exclusive set to Michael's as well, which is really annoying, because they're probably going to be really expensive there. I, I never seen my stream anything. No, I think it's in the States, though. Oh. Not in Canada. Canada has a small pop section, but it's nothing like the one in the States anyway. Um, so, yeah, we're also going over to GameStop today because I want to pick up the Stranger Things Season 3 ones. Those are going to be really cool. I have Lucas, but I want to see if they've got the rest of the set when we go over there. So, anyways, we'll see you guys in a second. I think the first stop will be... What do you think? Where's the first stop, Mom? Mm, GameStop. Maybe GameStop. GameStop? Maybe. Okay, guys. GameStop. All right, guys, our first stop is GameStop. Let's go in and see what's new. Oh, there's no one. Okay, guys, so here we are over here. They actually have buy three, get one free right now, which is really cool. I did find a Pez that I don't have, which is Carl Spackler. I'm actually really excited about this. Only $4.99, too. Um, what else they got over here? They've got power armor. They've got a bunch of Pez up top here. Um, I do see the Superman. This one is the Jim Lee Deluxe one, which is really cool. Now, we also found this up here, which is the Dr. Peter Venkman with Firehouse. Now, I'm going to want to get this one today. This one is a must for my collection. I want to try and get all three of them. So far, I think there's three. I don't know what number one is. I think it's the number one is the Scooby-Doo. It looks really nice, too. Yeah. This is like one of the last ones I need for the set. So I think one of the last ones is Scooby-Doo with his house. I think that's number one, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and it's not out yet, so we're going to have to wait for that one. But I did just, uh, well, I'm not going to mention it now, because but we did get one in the mail. Um, what else do we have over here? We've got uh, Jesse, some Spider-Man ones. We've got a bunch of Fortnite ones over here. They've got this DC superhero one that I don't see too often, actually, but that looks really cool there. Uh, what else we got down here? we got some other ones. Yeah, I know. We've got some other ones down here. Cam, Mitch... Um, some of the Shape of Water, Howard Wallowitz, uh, Randy Orton, Betty Boop, Devil. Um, but yeah, because I'm going to keep looking around. Maybe we'll find some other Stranger Things ones, maybe? You never know. Okay, guys, so we found them. Uh, we've got Max, Eleven, Battle Eleven. We've got Steve. Now this is his uh, Scoops Ahoy outfit, which looks That's really cool. Going, right? We've got Will the Wise, and then Lucas again. I already have Lucas, which is still really cool. And then we have Hopper and Dustin up here. Oh, yeah, Max, or Will the Wise is the one. I showed off Max. That's a good one, actually. So I think we're going to be getting four of them today. Um, cause these are really cool ones, but there is a lot of them. Um, I don't know which ones yet, but uh, we're going to keep... What do they buy? Three, get one. It's buy three, get one free, right? Yeah, yeah okay. So we're going to keep digging around, see if uh, we'll pick up four of them anyway. All right, guys, our next stop is Walmart. I'm hoping for some new exclusives because there are some, so let's go in. Okay, guys, so I just remembered that there should be an Overwatch section here, and I know, Noah, you're a big fan of Overwatch. Do you still play Overwatch? Yes. Yeah, so uh, let's see if they've got the exclusive one. All right, guys, so here we are. Um, they do have some new Earth stuff. Um, doesn't look like too much that I'm looking for, though. They do have some Pez. This looks like new Pez. Um, they have a lot of Batman, actually. Do they have any Chase ones, just for fun? Let's see if they do. Um, doesn't look like it. No. They have a Goose with Flurkin. I'm guessing that this is... Or Goose Flurkin, sorry. I'm guessing that the Chase one's probably gone as well from that. But they do have some Fortnite ones. Not the ones that I'm looking for. As well, not much else. So, yeah, guys, I think we're going to keep looking around. They do have some other Pez down here, actually. The Harry Potter ones are nice. Um, there's a Chase Hulk one as well. I sure it's gone by now um but it's always good to check just in case but yeah i don't i don't see anything so anyways also i don't see the overwatch section or the pop so i'm guessing they haven't got that in yet so anyways let's keep looking around all right guys we made it over to Foot Locker to see what they've got and also hey there's no one again hey guys over here they've got a bunch of diy ones they've got pop female down here and they've got some pop male ones those are cool if you want to do some diys on them but they do have some black panther ones we've got t'challa and then we have eric killmonger and nakia up here as well this one's actually a really nice one. All of these are pretty cool ones, actually. I like the Black Panther line. Um, also, guys, back here, if I can come over here, they've got some Pickle Rick ones. Over here, they got Pickle Rick. Some Rick and Morty ones, actually, are really nice. Um, they've got some Mystery Mini, some Overwatch ones, Star Wars. they got the Game of Thrones one, Daener uh, Daenerys Tigerian over here, which is pretty cool. This is cool because Game of Thrones just recently ended. Most of you guys know that, though. Um, we got Eleven Hospital Gown, Demogorgon, some vinyls down here. A couple of the kid robot figures I do see. We got some Michael Jordans behind the counter over here, which are pretty neat. I already have one. I'm not going to pick one up today. But cool that they got them in again. So anyways, let's keep going. All right, guys, we made it to Target, so let's see what's new. Hey, guys, so look what I just found over here. Two 
10 inch Bulbasaur. I already have one, so I'm not going to be picking one up today, but the Niagara Falls Target has two of them as of this video coming out, or as of last night, sorry. Anyways, yes, they do have two. As for back here, they don't seem to have much that I'm looking for. Actually, nothing that I'm looking for today. Rye, the pop guy, um, if you're watching, because I know you watch all of my videos, um, they have the Sentient Armorty. Um, yeah, he still needs this one. He needs six Rick and Morty ones from what's out so far, not the new wave. And that's one of them. Like, come on, he has the Chase version, at least. Um, but yeah, here's what they've got back here. Not much that I'm looking for. Retsuko Date Night's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, other than that, not too much. So, let's go over to the Toy Story section, because I saw something over there you guys are going to like. Hey guys, so over here in the Toy Story section, they actually have this. It's the Flocked Bunny. Um, I already have this one, but it is a really cool one. We have Bo Peep with Officer Giggle McDimples. We've got some Woodies. We've got Buzz. Now, they are they do have these, which are only $5.99. I want to pick these up. These are the last two out of the Toy Story ones that they had last time. They just don't have the case out. Uh, but they do have the Flock Bunny, which is an exclusive to here, so pretty neat. All right, guys, so we are back from the store now, and we have a pretty big bag from GameStop today. This is probably the most I've spent at GameStop ever title. I'm not going to call it that. I actually have a better title. Um, so we went Stranger Things Funko Pop Hunting. I got some other stuff as well, but I think we're going to start with the other stuff first, just because I want to show that off. Um, one thing that I got today was the Dr. Peter Vankman with Firehouse here. Um, this is a really cool one. I love this thing. So I'm trying to get all of the Pop Towns. I seem to, I seem to take a shine towards the bigger Pops. Now, Mom, you're here too, because she's in the room. Mm -hmm. Um... But I, you, you can agree with me on this. I like yeah. the 10-inch pops. I like the 6-inch ones. Well, because they are unusual, right? They're and they're different. The, they're not the same size as all the others. Right. This is my first one, guys. So I think we're going to pop this one out of the box real quick just to show it off. I'm not going to go too in detail with it. If you guys want to see reviews on this, uh, let me know. I can. Um, but I just want to take it out of the box real quick just to show you guys um, what this looks like. Because I haven't seen this in person yet. I remember when it was at Toy Fair, they were going to add a couple things to it, such as slime coming out of the window. And yeah, they did, actually. Um, here it is here, guys. So they added this little bit of slime out the window. I don't think that was on the, the one at Toy Fair, um, which is kind of funny. But they do have the Ghostbusters logo on the front there. I don't know how the Ecto-1 is supposed to get out of there with that giant sign. Um, but, you know, they do that. To, they, they accentuate it because, you know, that's the, the main part of the actual uh, building here. I do really like the way this looks, though. If they have, like, a bunch of this, like, from different um, shows and television shows and movies and stuff like that, it'd be cool to have them all of them lined up. Um, but for Sesame this... Street would be cool. Sesame Street. Oh, you're right. Big Bird's Nest would be cool. cool. I think that would be neat. Um, then it also comes with... This one is Dr. Peter Vankman. He is marshmallowed. Um, to go with the 10-inch, um, well, what would it be? Stay Puffed, which is coming soon. I pre-ordered that from GameStop, so we'll have to pick that up sometime. It's only going to be about 30 bucks, I think. Um, so I'm really excited about picking that one up when it comes out. Uh, I don't know when it is, but I did see some people um, posting photos of it online, so maybe it'll be soon. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited about that one. So anyways, let's put this one away, and then we'll move on to the other stuff that I've got here. I have a bunch of other things that I want to show off. Um, so what happened was is there was a deal going on right now where it was like if you spend fifty dollars you get ten dollars off your next purchase. If you spend a hundred you get uh, I believe it was twenty five off your next purchase. So I bought this one as well. This one isn't to fit with the Stranger Things ones. I bought Agent K and Nebel or Nebel. Agent K and Nebel. This one's really funny from Men in Black. Um, uh, we used to watch this movie a fair bit actually. This is one of those ones that you, it'd be on TV or we'd throw it on on Netflix or something. Um, I believe it was on Netflix. I think it was. But anyways, it's a really cool one. Ne Nebel's really cool because he's on the coffee pot. And you really only see them in the uh, in the little break room drinking coffee. And I think that's really funny that they added that. Um, I don't know if they're in the movie more than that. I'd have to think about it. Anyways, that's a really cool one. So let's get into the Stranger Things ones. And then I also have the two um, Target exclusive Toy Story Mystery Minis that I want to open up at the end of this video. So stay tuned for that. Um, but here, guys, let's just start with this one. So we have Hopper here. This is a really cool one. Hopper is uh, one of my favorites, actually. He's a great guy from the show. I have Hopper from the other wave. Um, this is their, them all kind of like in their summer outfits. Because if you notice, this this season isn't coming out in October. It's coming out in July. July 4th, actually. So a lot of them are wearing like summerish outfits. Um, so here we also have Max wearing, you know, kind of summerish. Again, she's got her sunglasses on. You know, she's got her shorts on, t-shirt. So it does seem kind of like more summery than the other seasons do. Um, I really do like these pops. This set is really awesome. There's only one pop in this set that I don't have now. Um, and I'll show you that one in a second. Um, here we go. Here, guys. We also got Steve from Stranger Things wearing his Scoops Ahoy. Um, if you, <laughs> this was funny. I was watching Rai's video, Rai the Pop Guy. He called it Chips Ahoy in the video. <laughs> and I thought that was pretty funny. 
Um, but anyways, there's that one right there. Yeah, mom's laughing at that one. Um, here we go, here guys. We've also got Will the Wise. This one's a funny one. I'm guessing this is when they're playing Dungeons and Dragons. Probably something to do with that. Um, we'll have to find out when the show comes out, but I am really excited about seeing this one and where it plays into the show. Um, really funny one. I'm glad they didn't make another Will by itself, like a normal Will, because there is like two or three of them already. So it's cool that they changed it up a bit. Here we have Eleven. This is her in her, um, you know, she's got like a dress on, or I don't know exactly what you call that. Maybe not a dress. It's shorts and a t-shirt, but it's connected. What are those called, Mom? Romper? Romper? Yeah, it's well, a romper. Let me, see. let me see. Perhaps. It's all one. Like, do you know what I mean? She's wearing like one oh, yeah. suit. Is that a romper? I don't know. I don't know if that's what it's called. It anyway, seems... something like that. She also has, looks like a bag in her hand and some shoes on. I just don't want to get it wrong because it's not really a dress. It's more of something. I don't know what it is. Anyway, let's move on to the next one. We have the other 11 one. This is Battle 11. So this is her um, bloody and then she's got the um, blindfold on her bird box actually kind of reminds me of that. It does remind me of that. It What's does. What's up with that? It's weird. I don't know. I'm sure they did it before bird box or maybe they didn't. I don't know. Um, but yeah, the blindfold kind of reminds me of that. I don't know. Maybe it's a nod to it, but I wouldn't think so. Stranger Things likes to do their own thing. Uh, but anyways, guys, the last one that we've got here is this one is from Camp Nowhere. And of course, guys, it's Dustin. Can't forget about Dustin. There he is right there. Really cool one. So there is the exclusive 11 coming to Hot Topic, which should have been out today. I just couldn't go over to Hot Topic. Um, and then there was also the exclusive Dustin, um, which is to Walmart. And there's also another one to GameStop where he's got his toolbox. So that's pretty cool. Um, but there is one more thing that I forgot to show off right at the beginning there, which is a Pez that I picked up. Um, you guys probably saw which one it was. It's Carl Spackler from uh, Caddyshack here. I don't have this one. I have the pot, but I didn't have this one. So there it is right there, guys. Super excited about getting this one. Now I have the full set of the um, Caddyshack Pez. So there's all the pops that we picked up today, guys. I know a lot of you guys were saying in the comment section below that I should pop hunt when I have more of the figures available to me. So this one was one that I knew that I could get more of them. Uh, I knew that they were coming out today, so I thought, hey, let's pick up some of the set, or most of the set. I also have Lucas. Um, he's somewhere in my pile over here. If Here's I... the deal. Like, sometimes when we pop up for something, only one is available, so we just want I know. to show it to people as soon as we can. But then again, yeah, like that, but then maybe I just title the video something different instead and then yeah, wait to, to advice, do more. Advice. I do like that, yeah. It's actually and really... the person that said it was very respectful. They no, yeah, it no. It, it was it was all good. You know, it was constructive criticism. Yeah, um, so anyways, um, I took their advice and we decided to do every single one pretty much. Well, as many as we could get. Yeah, everyone but um, Erica. They didn't have Erica. I ha Or they had Lucas, but I didn't get it because I have him somewhere, which, sorry about that. Um, if you guys want to see the set... On the back here, here's the back of Eleven's box mm. as well. They changed up the box, so it looks pretty good, actually. I like it. Um, but anyways, guys, let's move these off to the side, and then we'll open up the mystery minis. All right, guys, so we are back. Um, I do have the other mystery minis here. We're just hoping for no duplicates, Mom. If you want to guess what you think we're going to get, I think I have one of the boxes still, don't I? Mm. Oh, I wish I did. One of the... You uh... have the box in front of you. No, I know, but I wanted one of the ones so you could look at it so you could guess. Oh, it's okay. Uh, I'm going to guess. I'll guess. Oh, okay, yeah. If you, want, you want me to name them? see the side? Yeah, like... Here, let me name them here. Woody, Buzz, Bullseye, Jesse, Rex, Alien, Combat Carl Jr., Gabby Gabby. Uh, we have Benson. I think his name is Benson. Is it Benson? Sorry, if I get that wrong. Sorry about that. Um, we have Forky, Bunny, Duke Kaboom, D uh, Ducky, Bo Peep, the exclusive one. We have... Officer Giggle McDimples, the exclusive one, and then Woody, black Okay, and white. I'm gonna guess Woody and whoever the chicken is. Uh, Ducky. Mm -hmm. I, his name's Ducky, mom. He's a okay. duck. Okay. Okay. Anyways, uh, we're gonna get into this one here, guys. Uh, I mean, I don't blame you. Uh, here we go. Here, let's get right into this. I'm super excited about these two. So these are the same ones from the set that we got. This one, which I fixed. You guys, let me know that this one was broken. I put the. Uh, the part of her staff back on there. Um, I got Woody out of that one, and then I also got Benson. So that's the three of them right there that I got. Um, so those are really good ones. This one's a one in 72 as well. So this case has been pretty good. So we're hoping that I get some better stuff. Also, if you guys wanna see the ratios here, um, that's what they are. There you go, right there, guys. So let's see what we got going on. I'm really hoping we can get Officer Giggle McDimples, and then I can just move over to the uh, Michael's set because I really do want to complete this one because I, I love Toy Story and I think it'd be really fun to complete it. Oh, bad. Really? No. Are you kidding? What? We got the. No, it's the wrong one. What did you think I it thought was? it was. Actually, you know what? To be fair, I don't have this one yet. 
Okay. Um, I was just thinking it was Officer Giggle McDimples. It's the alien that's not glow in the dark. Um, so this one is a one in twelve. Not and too. Not it's too horrible. Cool to have more than one alien. No, I do like. Because actually, you know what? It's not that it's bad. Not that I was bad. just building it up yeah. in my head. It was Officer yeah. Giggle McDimples, and yeah. I thought I had all three of the exclusives. But do you um, agree? I, I know I do agree with that one. But here, guys, if you guys want to see the difference, it's really not that different. You can tell which one glows in the dark. It's the one that I'm shaking here. Um, both of them look great, though. Same sculpt, just one of them's glow in the dark. <laughs> I was really excited about that one there. Mm -hmm. But here we go here, guys. Let's move into... Let's move on to the next one here. Because um, I'm pretty excited about this. I will show off the rest of them that I have after as well. I, I bought the Hot Topic exclusive ones. And I think I got all three of them, if I'm not mistaken. Because it was Buttercup. It was the, the Bullseye. And then it was also... Maybe I'm missing one of them? No, I swear I... Oh, it was the Glow in the Dark Alien. Right, so I got all three of them out of that. So that's good. Um, now we're just looking to get some other ones. And if I miss this one, it's going to be kind of sad because I don't want to have to dig through a whole other case somewhere to try and get it. I don't think... Huh, I'm feeling it. I shouldn't be feeling it. Oh! Double? I believe so. Yeah, this is our first ever double. Um, we got a second Gabby Gabby. Well, to be fair, in the first set, actually... Um, I had doubles because Buzz and Woody were doubles because I bought a full case. So first ever doubles, Gabby Gabby. What what ratio is she actually? I think she's pretty high up actually. Yeah, she's a 1 in 24, so that's, that's not weird. horrible. And the one that I'm looking for, of course, is a 1 in 12. So oh, wow. yeah, yes. I get the more I get the more rare one. Anyways, um, so yeah, we're doing pretty good with this set. Out of the uh, normal set, I am missing, what do we got here? A bunny and Ducky, uh, Combat Carl Jr. and Duke Kaboom. And then for the exclusives, I'm missing... Oh, I think I'm also missing Jesse. Yeah, I'm also missing Jesse. Um, and then for the normal one, I'm missing... Or for the exclusive, I'm missing Officer Giggle McDimples. And then whatever the three are for um, Michaels. So anyways, I'm going to have to find this one. What I'll probably do is if I see another case of these somewhere, feel for the lightest one and just go for that. Because it's a 1 in 12, it should be in every case. So if I can find a normal case, go for a really light one because... It's either Officer Giggle McDimples or Combat Carl Jr. that are going to be super light. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more from me in the future, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you guys enjoyed this video, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, but anyways, this has been another episode of Top Pops. Popsters, thanks for watching. Now let's catch up to that truck. All right, just on 59, somebody thought they'd bring their remote control car literally on the freeway. Dude, this is 59 South. Look at this guy. He just exited. That was his exit, apparently.